Sheila Hakim and Sheila from <laughs> Hi, how are you doing? Hi, How's it going? Her. Thanks for coming yeah. by. Uh, you're here to talk about the launch party for Mariposa Plaza. Yes, yes. How come you're the person to come by? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> you don't, <laughs> tell me your involvement. I was I was very involved with the uh, project. I was called yesterday by a few other team members that um, I should come and cover up today. So this is a project we've been involved with since 2012. My gosh, mm -hmm. long time has passed. So um, it's a, um, a National Art Endowments grant. It's a very prestigious grant, and Fresno is um, very fortunate to get this uh, grant for mm -hmm. an a project that supports an interactive art for Mariposa Plaza. Mm -hmm. And that would be an um, art that is not like a, a traditional art that you see on a pedestal or um, similar to what we see on Fulton Mall or other part of downtown. It's going to be um, an art that transforms the space and people can interact with. And uh, we're going to have a national call for our artists to come in and um, I'm sure uh, many people from all over the United States are going to participate and the panel will pick one and then uh, that artist will create an art piece. How large of an art piece are we talking? Because I'm looking at your flyer here and the prominent thing on that flyer is the clock tower. Yes. Is the clock tower staying? The clock tower is uh, moving to the corner of where the Mariposa Plaza is now. That's, that's what I know. And that's what the plans for Fulton Mall is gonna is calling for. So and, and this grant, we're gonna be able to paint it. Uh, hopefully, right? yeah. <laughs> yeah, and repair it. Isn't that now, the, the the Mariposa Plaza. A lot of people out there. This is the free speech area. This is gonna be the exact center of downtown when Fulton Mall is taken out and the Fulton Street is put in. This is gonna be the area where the street the street parties are going to be at. Exactly. You know, the significance of Mariposa Plaza is that it's not just, I mean, the history of it and what the future is, is calling for it. Mariposa Plaza is going to be the the, the gateway to future high-speed train, mm -hmm. hopefully, if it comes. The, 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 the station, the Mariposa Plaza will walk right into the station, exactly, right? Exactly, exactly. So the station is going to be at H Street and Mariposa Street, mm -hmm. I guess, what right. that is going to be. And, um, you know, let's just think about it. The, the high-speed train coming to the United States for the first time, the station, the first station is going to be here in Fresno, and it awesome. right open to the Mariposa Plaza. So the significance of the space is enormous, and I, I hope everybody realizes it and be, want to be part of it. And, and being, being that it's coupled with the, with the new Fulton Street coming in, it's going to transform downtown, make, make it a really beautiful area. Exactly, yeah. And then when we're looking, and this is an event space. Many um, events throughout the year happens at Mariposa Plaza already, mm -hmm. and thousands of people participate. We have a... Um, Cinco de Mayo, which is, I think, coming in uh, May. It usually comes about May. Yeah, yeah. and then we had Catacomb uh, party, I think, which uh -huh. happened. The, yeah, the Catacomb, Catacomb party. Catacomb yeah. party happened a few weeks ago, and Ice Ring is there. I mean, it's been the third year or the second year that we're having the Ice Ring. Right. So many people, thousands of people visit, and this um, space has the opportunity to become a regional destination for awesome. for everybody to come and enjoy awesome and, and when the, the street parties uh come after everything's built it's going to be really cool because from what i understand they'll have these hydraulic poles in the ground that will pop up out of the street and close off the street immediately yes and and, and uh, that would create um, provide a bigger space for that uh, can accommodate different events and different population or public that want to attend those events. Talk a little bit more about your involvement. You said you've been doing this since 2012. What have you been doing? Yeah, I'm a, I'm a local um, uh, designer, urban designer, background in architecture. I've been in the Valley since uh, 2000, started at, in Visalia and then moved back to graduate school, came back to Fresno and I, um, I, I decided to you know, make Fresno my home. And um, we don't have many urban design firm, you know, uh, firms here in in Fresno. And I decided to to be the one who started. I think uh, urban design. Yes. Yeah. And urban design is um, um, looking at the public space, whatever sits between the um, the buildings. It's a bridge between all these uh, different um, you know professions, planning, 
architecture, landscape architecture, and really uh, looking at how a public space is supposed to interact. It can be a street, it can be a plaza, mm -hmm. it can be even the facade of a building. So whatever that public interacts with it. So that's what I, um, I you know, my profession deals with. And uh, 2012, a group of us, including some people that are not here anymore, we got together and we decided to uh, to go for the second round from for a NEA grant, mm -hmm. and Mariposa Plaza was the site. It was um, a very um, a good effort to bring people in. Community <coughs> Hospital was part of it. Um, Fresno Arts Council, Fresno Art Museum, um, and um, Creative Fresno. Uh, so many stakeholders and interested uh, downtown organization and people. Uh, we're part of it. We put together the application and we got a $150,000 grant from NEA. There's going to be a match for it in, in kind and cash. So we're talking about above $300,000 wow. project. Wow. And, but there, there was another rather large grant for Mariposa Plaza. Uh, from from the government, wasn't there? That was that's the Fulton Mall grant. That's the um, um, transportation, the, um, the tiger the, grant, the tiger grant, the sixteen million dollar, and that is gonna um, pay for for opening the Fulton Mall. So, are you excited about this? I am excited. Do you think this is what downtown needs? I I think um, I, I hope so. I hope so. I mean, uh, that's definitely a good effort going to on on its way. I think uh, downtown needs. Um, some some new vision, mm -hmm. and I, I hope this is going to be the one. And but the Mariposa Plaza is kind of the donut hole right in the middle. The grant that grant is not going to touch the plaza, so plaza is uh, left for us. Pretty awesome. How, how do you foresee the plaza when it's finished? I think it's going to be. I mean, we um, the problem now the plaza has. There's a stage that the stage is actually not very much used. The events that come to the stage, sometimes they have to make their own stage in different areas of the plaza. The sun is, uh, is not helping out. So it, there are some um, pictures uh, that you can find it, I think, on the Fresno Downtown Partnership website that you see that on um, the Cinco de Mayo um, uh, event, people are standing underneath the trees. So this is uh, real. This is a space that people want to use and it can accommodate. So I see through our project, we plan and we built something there that can accommodate different size of events. And uh, this will be the focal point for, for gathering. And I think what Mariposa Plaza is going to provide is going to help Fulton Street to, to thrive too. That's, awesome. We're going to draw people there. Talk about the launch party. The launch party, yeah, that's, that's, the, that's the reason I'm here, isn't it? So yes. it's tomorrow <laughs> night, 6 to 8, um, Mayor Ashley Srinjian and... My Valentine. Oh, yeah? Yes. Okay. <laughs> and the, um, the council member, Oliver Baines, um, the, the, that's the kind of, he's a council member for this district. They're going to be there. They're going to address the, uh, the crowd, but it's not very formal. When the project partners, um, we have uh, different groups, uh, Fresno Art Museum people, Fairs and Arts Council people, and uh, the design group that includes me and a nationally known uh, firm in San Francisco, WRT. We're going to be there and do a very, very brief presentation, talk to the people, and then after that, it's really party. So we hope to, to get some beer there. People can, can drink beer, have some appetizer from Peeves, and, um, and just talk about it, get to, uh, to know us, let us to hear them, and, and get, get them more involved. So be there. Come over there. You know what, Sheila? You just proved my point so, so strongly that I always tell people that my job's really pretty easy because once I get someone sitting next to me that has a passion about something uh -huh. and some knowledge about something, it, all I have to do is ask a few simple questions <laughs> and, the, and they do the rest. I, your first time on television, you did great. Thank you thank so you much. Thank you very much thank for coming for down and thank you for what you're doing for downtown. Thank Fresno. you so much. We're going to take a quick commercial break.